Today I'm going to show you how to make this easy low carb chicken stir fry that uses a pre-mixed broccoli slaw to stand in for using rice or noodles. Okay, so I've got my ingredients assembled here and some of them are chopped and some of them I've got to do yet. But I'll just tell you quickly, I've got, this is four boneless, skinless chicken thighs that we've cut in thin strips. And I've got one bunch of broccoli that I've also sliced very thin because I want it to cook really quickly. So as you can see, I've sliced the florets in very thin. Um, I've got two stalks of celery, which I'm also going to slice thinly, and one bunch of green onions or scallions that I'm also going to slice very thin. Then I've got two bags, um, 250 grams each. I've got 500 grams total, which is about a pound. Of, you can use broccoli slaw. I can't find that here in Australia, so I've got what they call a rainbow salad, which is kind of similar. It does have broccoli and carrot and beetroot and I think some cabbage in there. So it's about the closest thing I can find to a broccoli slaw. I'm going to use that. One cup of water, half a cup of soy sauce or tamari, use the low sodium if you can. I've got two tablespoons of soy, uh, sorry, sesame oil, and two tablespoons of minced ginger. Then the seasonings, I've already got them all mixed together in this little cup here, but what I've got is two teaspoons of onion powder, one teaspoon garlic powder, one teaspoon of red chili flakes or red pepper flakes, and what, I, what you can't see here is there's also a, um, a half a tablespoon of a sugar substitute. So you can use Splenda or Stevia or something that you like that's already mixed in there. So I'm going to slice the rest of these vegetables next. As you can see, I want this stir fry to come together and cook really quickly. So I'm just slicing them very thin. To start with, you can use a large sautéing pan. Um, I'm going to have uh, use my wok because it's big enough because this is actually kind of double the normal recipe. Um, so the first thing we're going to want to do is using this pan, we're going to stir fry the chicken in the ginger and sesame oil. So I've got my sesame oil going in first. Pan's already hot. And the ginger. And we're going to get the chicken in there right away. And start frying. I've been stir frying that for about three minutes so that the chicken's all nicely browned as you can see. It doesn't have to be totally cooked through because it's still going to cook for a while. But at this point, we're going to add the water, soy sauce, and our seasonings. Now, normally, according to the recipe, you would just sort of simmer this for about five minutes before we add uh, the other vegetables. Because I'm using broccoli, I probably will put those in a couple minutes early just because they may take longer than the rest of the vegetables. Now it's been nearly five minutes. I'm going to put my broccoli in right away because as I said that might need just a little bit longer to cook than the other veggies. Um, once the broccoli slaw goes in and the, and the onions and that, um, that only needs a couple minutes. You don't want to overcook that because it'll get mushy. But I do want to make sure the broccoli is cooked tender. Just stir fry that for a couple of minutes and then we'll add the rest of the ingredients. Okay, so now I'm ready to add the rest of the veggies which is the chopped onion and um, celery. And our broccoli slaw, or in my case, the rainbow slaw. Now this is sliced very thin, so it won't need but maybe two minutes. And this will be done. All right, that's been stir frying for just about two, two and a half minutes. And I reckon it's perfect. Now, don't be put off by the color of mine. Because my um, broccoli slaw mix had sliced beet or beetroot in it, it tinged the color a bit, so everything looks a little bit red. If you're just using a straight broccoli slaw mix, that won't happen to you. It's still going to taste really good. Don't worry about that. Let's dish it up. And there you have it. A quick and easy low-carb chicken stir-fry using broccoli slaw instead of noodles or rice.